What up loves? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a quick little video giving you five quick and easy updos for curly hair when it's time to wash and you just don't feel like washing it yet or you're just bored and tired of wearing your hair the same old way. It's really simple. All you're gonna need are some bobby pins and what I suggest in terms of bobby pins are getting professional grade bobby pins, not the ones that you can get at like CVS or Walmart. If you go to Sally's Beauty Supply, they have some really good heavy duty bobby pins that look like this. They're very heavy duty and sturdy and they hold a lot more hair so you'll have to use a lot less of them to get your hair to stay in place. You're gonna need some hair ties and some good hairspray. I love Kenra volume spray. That's just my preference, but you can use whatever hairspray you want. I'm obviously an advocate of professional styling products because they do work a whole lot better than the cheap stuff you can get at drugstores, but use whatever you want. So let's begin. For the first style, the first thing I do is take a bunch of hair in the front and I bunch it up and I kind of like to do it a little bit more angled and I just take a few bobby pins and pin them in on each side just making sure that it's secure any pieces that you see kind of flying away just pin them in just like so and boom you're done for the second look all I do is use the same bunching in the front and work with that I pull the hair up pull some pieces out just on the sides for a little bit of softness and fringe I take a hair tie and I just tie it very loosely at the top of my head smoothing out the edges so that there's no like big chunky pieces sticking out when I'm done putting it in a hair tie I just kind of smooth out the edges I take some hairspray and I spray it and take a little bit of the hairspray in my fingers just smoothing out some of the frizz I don't really like when my hair is really frizzy so the messy look is in but I still like it to look clean so I take hairspray spray it smooth it fluff it and I'm done for the third look I'm starting from scratch so I take my hair but I part it on the side this time and instead of bunching it in the middle I bunch it kind of off to the side take some bobby pins and pin that side in to make it secure now I take the other side and I pin it back and up take more bobby pins secure that side in crisscrossing the bobby pins helps sometimes just to make sure that it's really secure now I'm taking the top half of my hair and pulling it up and then I pull down the hair just leaving as much down as I want while tying up the rest. Then I just fluff the top ponytail up and then kind of blend it a little bit and spray it. I decided to pull out a couple pieces on the side just for a little softness and fringe but obviously you don't have to and that's it. Number four, I'm going to take this ponytail down and then pull all of my hair up to the top of my head, still using the same kind of bunching at the top in the front. I take my hair tie and I take it to the very top of my head and just wrap it very loosely. So I only wrapped it around twice and I fluff it out and leave it at the top of my head and that's it. You can leave it as it is or you can pull out a couple pieces on the sides for softness and fringe. Last but not least, still using the same bunching in the front, I'm going to pull all of the hair really tight. I'm going to smooth it out with my hands, pull the fringe up, spray it really well, and just smooth it out as much as I can with my fingers. This particular look, I use a lot of hairspray because I like it to be really smooth, at least as smooth as I can get using my fingers. I still want it to be a messy type of look, but I don't want it to be really frizzy and bunchy. it pretty tight I think I did about three times around with the rubber band this time now 
I take the ponytail and very loosely wrap it around in a donut, if that makes any sense. Then I take the rubber band and I just use the rubber band and tie it around the hair just to secure it in. Then I take the flyaway pieces and I pin them in. I still want, I want the bun to be really full, but I don't want any pieces sticking out. I take it, pull it up, make it as full as I want. Pin all of the pieces in very gently that I want secured, and then I spray it in really, really well. there was driving me absolutely crazy so I just wanted to make sure I smooth it out so I took a bobby pin and took care of that and it's as simple as that I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you like this video give me a thumbs up don't forget to comment and subscribe and I'll see you in my next one